Hey yo, what's going on guys? Today I'm with my homie Debo. We're gonna be debating Dedua vs uh, Sasui. I got Dedua, my man's got Sasui. You wanna say anything before we debate? Um, shout out to all my thick nimbus. That's all. <laughs> shout out to my thick nimbus. All right. All right. You wanna go on your scaling fours? You want me to go on my scaling? Uh, you can go first. All right, all right. Uh, let me let me just post this down in the thing below so it's easier. So basically, I'm doing uh, Dedua relative to Coast Monk 2 Sasuke, Coast Monk 2 Sasuke above base uh, Sasuke, base Sasuke above Sakura, Sakura relative to Sasuke. Okay, why is base Sasuke over Sakura? Um, we had the beginning of uh, Naruto Shippuden. It was li it was literally shown that like uh, he was able to like blitz all of them. Yamato couldn't see him. Naruto didn't see him. Even Sakura, like, you're talking about like at the very, very start. Yeah, I'm talking about like the beginning of Naruto Shippuden. Like, this is oh, why like, would that Sakura be the same Sakura that fights Sasori? Um, we, we know that we because it was what, like three days after, I believe, or four days after. All right, can you show me that? Can you show me like the time span? Because you know, just curious. Uh, <laughs> How do, you, how do you want me to send, send you the time scan? Because I don't have the scan. I don't that. know. Like, I'm just saying, like, is it, like, do you have any proof it's the same Sakura, right? Because, you know, logically, past the time, right, characters would get stronger, you know? Right, give me a second, because I have to go on the chapters when you fight the Sasui. Chapter 274. And if I'm remembering correctly, right, was that um before they met Orochimaru, right? Because then, um, did they meet Sasuke first, or did he meet Orochimaru, then he met Sasuke? Uh, I forgot, I like, I believe the it was movie. Sasuke, and then oh. Orochimaru, like, pours up behind him. Behind Sasuke, mm -hmm. and he, like, holds his hand, like, right before he was going to use killing. Yeah, let me see. Let me check, too. Yeah, give me a second here. I'm going to go on the part when he's, like, you just go to the bridge and whatever, and you find them or whatever. I just got to find the chapter. Yeah, I believe it's like a week after, or like a week after. Yeah, okay, so it's it's ten days after the, after they fight. Yeah, yeah. Let me send you that scan. Yeah. and then like doing this like ten ten days time period. Uh, of my knowledge, anyways, I don't, I don't, I don't believe that like Sakura was like ever training or like anything of the sort. Mhm. Mm right. And so, in the case where she um gets where you say like she gets blitzed by Sasuke, right? Uh, what's the like? Was Sakura taking it seriously? Because Sakura's just like chilling and she she's like the dude she's fell in love with. Wouldn't that make someone hesitate? Like, wouldn't that make them be like? I wouldn't you know necessarily what? say hesitate because I think it was clearly shown throughout like the series, like at the beginning, like uh, not the beginning, the ending of like the OG Naruto. You know how like he she starts training with uh, Lady Sanade. Naruto starts training with Jirai, right? As mm -hmm. I explained, we're gonna do what we're gonna. I know she didn't make the like... promise yet that she was gonna, like gonna kill Sasuke. That was later on, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, that was like halfway to like Naruto Shippuden. But like, yeah, so I would like, say, I like, think that's still, like, I would say that there wasn't any up. killing intent, but there was still intent to do what they got to do, you know what I mean? And it, it was, yeah, but I, I would out, say, like, just know? the fact of like seeing a friend, right? You seeing like this person who you've like been with, you know, throughout like your childhood, and they mean so much to you, and you see them again, you know, you're gonna hesitate, like, realistically. Well, I wouldn't necessarily hesitate because I don't think it was ever shown hesit hesitating because they legit sh show him and then I believe it's Naruto after he's like, okay, you're going to come with us now. And then, you know, like Yamato was there. He would, I think, I think we would agree that like Yamato would also kind of scale above Sakura in the circumstance. Even he wouldn't, he wasn't able to react. Naruto wasn't able to react. Like legit none of them were able to react. And this is like follow back up. He's like, uh, before this. Uh, what's called Wojimon is fighting the four tails and he legit states, Oh, this is nothing compared to what Sasuke gets. So it's like it's mm, just like well, full backing up like Sasuke really just truly scaling above all of them like at the beginning of like Naruto Shippuden. Mm -hmm. Well, in this case, right, Yamato just notes that he like he's fast, right? But he's not like Sakura, right? Even like with Sakura, you can say like, okay, well she is actually getting in some way blitzed in some shape or form, right? I would like argue that 
uh, if, like after I say yeah. this point. But Yamato's just noting he's fast. It's not showing that like Yamato was blitzed anyway. You know what I mean? Like um, someone could be like, okay, so oh yeah, he's bad. Me, okay, so immediately after, uh, what's it called? Uh, Sasuke is dead ass about to blitz Sakura, and then Yamamoto makes the long block, and then he like straight up hits Yamamoto. Like it's implying that like right. Yamamoto flat so by him being able to block, it's implying that he doesn't think that Sakura was fast enough or strong enough to even handle Sasuke, so he puts himself in front of him. Like like I think it's a like, dead ass after this scan. Okay, wait. Can you show me that? And even it wasn't I mean, your original thing saying that like he blitzes Yamato then, but if Yamato is able to react, I'm to saying him, that like he blitzes like he was he was clearly shown being fast with them like all of them because like even after he's like you chose the wrong block and then he just stays up just hits him. Because right, so like I mean, even, even like with thing. soccer, she's not even like in an uh, offensive pose. They're not even like defensive, like defensive stance. She just like she's like astonished that she's seeing Sasuke again. You know what I mean? Like it's no it's no resolve, no nothing. She just she just. Oh shit, Sasuke! Like she's fucking, uh, she's just nutting at this point. She's seeing her dude titties out and shit. Uh, I don't know. It, it looks, I don't know. It look like, and just like my to, man. Just, and just to be clear, like flustered. you have nothing, you have nothing wrong with the beginning of the scale, right? Just to make that clear. Yeah, just uh, just with base Sasuke being like over Sakura, okay. and then like Sakura being a relative to Sasuke, I kind of disagree with too. Yeah, yeah. I don't mind gotcha. like uh, Dedera and the Hibi Sasuke. And Curse Mark 2 being like relative. I don't mind that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm looking at the, the chapter right now. Let me get this screenshot this real quick. They need to make bookmarks for Shoney Jump. No cap. Fox. <laughs> I'm tired of having to look through the entirety of the fucking scene. <laughs> Yo, Fox. Like, come this. on, bro. Let me bookmark these, dog. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, so you, the you, man's is about the blitz. And then it's further implying, like, Yamato legit has the same, like, I both implying that, like, she was about to get blitz. She was about to get, like, whole incredibly bad. There's, like, nothing that implies that, like, Sakura even somewhat scales to this, to this, what's it called, to this Sasuke, right? And we also, we still have that statement of, like, the Fold Hills coming versus Orochimaru, and Orochimaru just like, this is nothing compared to Sasuke, right? So, like, you have multiple mm -hmm. instances which imply that Sasuke should just 100% scale above beginning uh, Sakura. The Sasuke okay, so, uh, my rebuttal against this would just be, like, Yamato is the mentor, right? He's the teacher. Mentors protect their students. That's just a base thing. Like, regardless of if Sakura could really handle it or not, right? We don't know. We can't, like, you know, I won't, like, make the statement that she 100% could. But just because mm -hmm. Yamato is being, like, a protective teacher... Right, a protective mentor over his students, it, it doesn't like inherently mean that Sakura just couldn't handle it. And even then, he mentions like his eyes, watch out, Sakura. So, this could be insinuating that he was going to use like Genjutsu, like whatever, you know, like just the mm -hmm. just seeing Sasuke's like Sharingan is a bit scary, even if you can't beat him, it's very haxy, you know what I mean. Yeah. So back to like for when it comes to that, like to rebuttal that, just like the like just to make it clear that like, he flats or scares above, I would just go back to like my point from earlier with like the Wochimaru statement, like him I believe at the time when he states that Naruto is in the three tail state, I believe. And he's like, This is still nothing compared to like Sasuke and this is like full old back though because even I believe like the three and three or four tails was like easily knocking over everything. Uh Sakura was literally got hurt, and then Yamato like dead ass said, "Hey yo, that was you, right?" So you have like multiple instances which show that like she, sh they should scale above. If that's from an auto can like hold clearly scales above, and then you have like a Wojimoto stating, "Yeah, this is nothing compared to Sasuke." It's like this full little statements implying that he just definitely should just scale above. All right, can you show me those? But um, pointing back to like Sakura getting like her yeah. ass washed by like the nine toes. Was it specifically she took it out by like the poison? Because the nine toes hit her and she got poisoned. And that's what, like, you actually, like, laid her out. Like, that's what put her ass on the ground. Uh, I have no knowledge of, like, the poison. So, like, right. if you can, like, Let me show you. Let me show you. Because after, after Naruto had, like, slapped her on the arm, uh, the Nine Tails, I don't know why they never bring this shit back up, but the Nine Tails basically, like, poisoned the dog shot her. And she was dealing with that poison for, like, quite a bit. Uh, and actually, like, had her off her game going for it. Let me send it. Up here. I'm trying to remember like okay, all the chapters right now. Same, bro. I mean, they're like the poison actually had 
basically left her quite weakened. And, and, and what did you say she got poisoned by? The Nine Tails Chakra. So uh, Yamato notes at like the bottom right, the Nine Tails Chakra Chakra is like a poison. It must have entered her body through her wounds. So that's what like really laid Sakura out was just like the poison. That's what really took her out. Yeah, but like, can like, uh, do you know it was like the three tails, the four tails? Because like, that still implies that like the um, four tails and this, three tails is still like standing above. Like, 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 even if you want to. Uh, what Roshimaru. form was he when he was fighting Rochimaru? Wait, at the I beginning he goes three that. tails, and then at the end he goes four tails. That's why I, I think he hit her at four. four tails. I think he hit her at four tails. But like, it wouldn't even matter. The point is just that like she got poisoned, and that's what like incapacitated her because she didn't have like a counter to it. Yeah, I would just say that that should still technically be above. Could still like that. We're talking like we're talking about like the nine tails in general, right? Well, four tails in a circumstance, right? It's still implying mm -hmm. that like it's scales above. So even if you want to say it, he has some ability in this circumstance to be poisoning, it's still showing that he scales above that. It clearly shown by the thing like you said, it clearly shown the harm hole. And even a was was just like that doesn't compel like he, like he, even Sasuke yeah Sasuke I'm, I'm saying that like the thing that really harms Sakura is just specifically the poison like the poison is what really does it if if not for the poison um there's nothing that shows that like Sakura wouldn't be able to at least be like in the area where she can like deal with it or like handle it comparably um let me let me ask you a question do you believe that like uh let's call it, like the the sun do you think beginning of Naruto Shippuden Sakura already surpassed uh what's her name it's, uh lady sonata sonata uh i don't nothing implies it yet so you, would, so you wouldn't agree with me if i said like, like uh what's called she's weak yeah i would agree with it like at the beginning yeah so like um what's it called it uh Immediately after this, there's like this one statement from Wojimo implying like the four tails can like even kill him with the dense chakra. And if like the Wojimo, like specifically the Legendary Signing, are somewhat supposed to be relative to each other or on par, it doesn't really matter what word he use in this sense. And he's mm -hmm. even stating that like he should still scale above that. And you agree that Sakura scales below that, that would still make Sa Sasuke scale above. Well, just, just to speak more on, like, the nine tail situation, right, uh, like, at this clip, even looking at it, Sakura seems to get hit because she's not even, like, she doesn't, she's kind of, like, out of it. She's trying to, like, help Naruto come back to his senses. Let me give you the timestamp. She's trying to, like, help Naruto come back to his senses. She's not even, like, trying to avoid the hit when it came. She's just so, like, she's like, oh, like, oh, fuck, Naruto's, like, this monster. She, because I don't think she's ever actually saw him in nine tails form. So she's, like, more astonished and just lost at that fact. And she's like crying and in tears. So I would just say this is a case of like her being like uh mentally what'd it be the word here? Um Do you know what the timestamp? Do you know the time stamp? Yeah, it's five minutes and thirty six seconds. Or yeah, five start minutes. like five minutes and thirty five to like see the full of it. Cause she like walks up, she's like in tears, right? Mm -hmm. You can like start from five five minutes and twenty three seconds. She's already in tears. She's not even like trying to fight, and she's just looking at Naruto, <laughs> just crying. So just like to make sure, like you're not saying anything about my point I said earlier, right? Um, in regards to what? When I was uh, trying to explain that, uh, what's it called? Oh, that because like she's weaker than Tsunade. Yeah, and like the Wojimo, Tsunade should be like on par with each other or like relative to each other, either or. And like, even he states. I would, himself, I would disagree. I would say like Orochimaru is higher. So if you were saying that Wojimo is even higher. Then Sanade, and then you agreed earlier that Sakura is even below that, and the Fold Heroes it has enough power to get like to kill a Wojimaru. Because even he states that this dense chakra can even has a chance to kill me. That would just follow prove that uh, Sasuke scale is above. Because he's I already showed you the statement earlier that he's like this. This doesn't compare to like Sasuke. So like I would just follow prove my point of like Sasuke. That would, in all, in all honesty, that would just upscale Sasuke. Okay, so wait, where's the scan where it states that, like, uh, like Naruto's power when he was fighting Rochimaru doesn't compare to Sasuke's? Uh, just scroll up, like, one like one thing above the link. The one where, like, a Rochimaru. Yeah, Little up. Fox, you are not even in the same league as Sasuke. So it's implying that, like, Sasuke is still above this in power, strength, overall. 
Even with a new jersey, that's the best you can do. And based off the yeah. things you just said, like well, a it's a ago. lot to account for when comparing like Naruto to Sasuke by this point. Like Sasuke has like literally the Sharingan, which negged the Nine Tails <laughs> with the Genjutsu. <laughs> so I think like when Orochimaru was like, "Your power doesn't compare." Naruto can't do jack shit if Sasuke is just like, "All right, I don't want you to use the Nine Tails today, bye, bitch," and just shut it off, like he did when they originally met. So I think it's just a matter of like, so like yeah, Sasuke having... he knew that was gonna happen. He has he has no knowledge of knowing that his Genjutsu would have been strong enough just to like torn off the Nine Tails. It's like there's nothing to prove. Well, we that. know that Sasuke has been training with Orochimaru. Yeah, but so it would be fair or, to say that he has There's knowledge. no proof that states that Orochimaru 100 percent knew that he could have just used Shargon and it would just torn off his Naruto. Like his uh, not Naruto, sorry, he torn off like the. Well, Naruto. we already know like Orochimaru sucks off the Sharingan heavily, and then we know that Sasuke is training with Orochimaru. So it's more of like a logical assertion to make to say that he would have knowledge, like just the same way how like a mentor would know what their student's capable of, right? At least like, even if you want to say 100%, 99.9% of what they would be able to do in the fight. Because Sasuke is training and fighting in Orochimaru's vision. Like he's in the, he's in the dude's crib training. <laughs> so Orochimaru would have to have some knowledge. He wouldn't just be like, oh, I don't know jack shit about what the Sharing guy could do. Like I don't. Who cares? You know. So like, like you know. So you you're saying that like he only states this, not necessarily in power. In terms of like stats, his, right? Okay, so it stats that when that also will create your know, your speed, power, stamina, because your stats is like everything in general, right? If I'm not correct, if you're saying stats, that sounds like stats with the S is was its plural. You're making it sound like he's he you like the general standpoint. So, I, so that's like that's I feel like that's kind of full of backing up my point about Sasuke scaling above beginning of Sakura. Well, like we have a full example of like what happens when Naruto and Sasuke fight. Naruto and Sasuke have this interaction. Sasuke immediately uses Genjutsu to incapacitate the Nine Tails. It's done. The fight, like it's nothing more that could really happen here. So Orochimaru, who is you know literally training and having Sasuke train in his area in his crib booty butt naked probably because you know how Orochimaru was doing probably out there naked bro seeing some little boy cheeks I feel like he has enough knowledge on Sasuke to know of his Sharingan capabilities and just generally because we know that um, Orochimaru yeah, was doing like, more based uh, off, like general like assumption, that's more based off of assumption like there's a difference between like base Naruto uh about to use nine tails and then there's naruto flatter with the nine tails because when you have naruto with the nine tails he already has all that enrage there he already has all that um oh, oh he has all that you know, he has like that boost of power already there right? mm -hmm. so there's nothing telling us that specifically that he would be able just to cut off when he's already in like the nine tails well are you are you saying like naruto couldn't get hit with genjutsu at this point I'm saying that there's no proof that specifically Sasuke beginning could use Shyugan to turn off like the Nine Tails if he's already in like this enraged state with all this boost of power and all this. Well, what would be like what I'm asking is like what would be the difference, right? Because we know like Genjutsu is almost like it's almost almost complete hacks. The Genjutsu itself can hit an opponent quicker than the actual like individual using it, you know? Well, like, it depends so on what's the, like that depends on like the Achiha and the circumstance. Yeah, of course. It depends on like the Chia, but we're talking about like one of the MCs, the brother of <laughs> the brother of Itachi that who's been training. That doesn't mean anything. Like that doesn't mean it anything. Means to a, me. It means quite a bit to be literally the blood relative of one of the goatest <laughs> and he gets in smacked through the entire series. Like let's be for real, he gets he was, smacked. He was being, no, the I'm saying he's at that level currently, right? I'm just saying that Sasuke has this lineage's bloodline that allows him these hacksy abilities. And he has these, like, he has the blood connection. And we know that Sasuke does eventually get to this point where he basically is doing everything that Itachi can realistically. You know, not exactly to the T, but enough to be better than the common ninja nigga who's walking around and better than the majority of Jinjirikis who can't counter Genjutsu. Well, and then, I, like, I, I wouldn't Tomorrow's say that isn't. because it's stated it that, like, Jinjirikis can just, like, overpower Genjutsu. Over Jinjiri. Yeah, we know later on. We know um, Jinjirikis that have, like, control of their Jinjirikis. Not just, like, someone like Naruto who... Kurama still is, like, fucking being a sundere. <laughs> like, <laughs> you know, it's different for Naruto. So, in Orochimaru's statement, it's not, like, clear-cut. He's not saying, like... It, it can be interpreted differently, which, in, in, my, um, in my view... 
makes it to where it's no like concrete answer. My interpretation of it can be valid since we literally see Sasuke do what I'm saying he would logically do, right? Mm -hmm. He's not gonna, he didn't let Naruto go nine tails and beat him that way. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. He said, I'm getting like, shut this bitch off. I'm like, no, bye bye. I don't wanna deal with it. <laughs> Yeah. So when Orochimaru was speaking of it, it can be implied to be saying that Sasuke just has means to get rid of shit like this. Like, he doesn't have to... Orochimaru has to run for his fucking life if he doesn't want to get... Like, he has to dip. Sasuke can just be like Genjutsu. Go! Well, let me let me ask you a question. Do you... Like, for me, personally, I think, like, uh, if I was... If, well, in this circumstance, Sasuke was needing to do genjutsu i still believe that he still needs to like scale above like for example some of the chias could put like the nine tails to genjutsu but not all of them right you need a certain level of like state of power like general power and in that circumstance like for gaku for gaku could put the nine tails um i'm pretty sure it's implied that itachi can i that, that that's a maybe though but overall point i think you still need general just flat out power i think that's where it still comes down to that power that speed to just look in that circumstance because it's not like he's just sweet when he can just put so, someone through again just like a whole country ass way right he still needs that power overall so i still believe that he should still scale above in this circumstance. Do you have anything like to say to that or like that? Yeah, you might go on G. Give you the G. Man's mic just broke real quick. <laughs> there you go. Okay. All right, all right. There you yeah. go. Back. Repeat everything you said. Damn. <laughs> cool. Um. Okay. So I was trying to say that, like, even if you wanted to put through, uh, what's called something through again, just you, I think you still would need the general like uh, speed and strength. And I used the example of like uh, how there's only a few Achiha members that have the strength to put kuma through uh genjutsu like for example like uh sasuke's dad which is like Fugaku. Mm -hmm. you still need that speed or strength to at least you know recognize the presence in a circumstance you know you can't just be some average you know average a chi in this circumstance and just put something through against it's you i think you still need that overall power and stats because it's not like everybody could just put the genjutsu like uh you know like not every other Achiha can just put the like, nine tails through against it you. you still need that power you know what I mean? Yeah, of course, but I'm just saying, like, yeah. um, I would say, like, in the cases like this, where it's not, like, too big of a gap, right? Because Sasuke doesn't need it. Even, like, he's even being relative to, like, the low ranges, right? Say if he's, like, at, like, the nine tails is, like, a ten, and he's, like, an eight. He can realistically still hit him with the Sharingan. Like, it, it's not impossible to get hit with the Genjutsu if you're in relative ranges of one another. You know, you mm. could be, you could be greater, right? You could say, okay, well... Sasuke's power out matches yours. Yeah, the Sharingan allows Genjutsu, which can one tap the majority of individuals who don't directly have a counter to it in some fashion. Like, I just think, like, the Orochimaru's statement would hinge more so on his Uchiha bloodline granting him access to shit like the Sharingan, which is just honestly a bit greater than the Nine Tails at this point. It just offers more capabilities in combat, and what Sasuke has access to is just a lot better. In terms of like hacks than what the nine tails could handle what naruto can reasonably handle mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah but like even with that like i would just go back to my general point like well we're mainly just gonna go back and forth so we can like i don't know st still mate on this point we can get like tg to like judge it yeah that's you cool wanna, you want to just conclude in this point real quick yeah that's cool uh, you want to go first or you want me to go first uh you wait before we do this uh you want to go to the sakura point next or is the sakura point included in this too uh, so I don't think we ever like reached a conclusion on that. Like soccer point? Do you mean like soccer? Um, like soccer is being like bitch or... by the tail, right? Because I, I feel like I feel like in the situation she was um she was just it was like what's the word? Fuck! I always say it. I don't remember. In like mentally, like, fucking... I'm talking about like just like scaling above like stats wise. Like I, I'm, not, I'm not like me personally. I'm not even talking about like that scene. I'm talking about like in mm -hmm. general stance. That's why I went to like the Wojimaro point. Well, is there any like more evidence besides this when it shows like um Naruto being like above Sakura like greatly? Um yeah, that's why I I brought up like the point earlier that uh that like I made you agree you agree that like a Sanade is above and then you agreed that like uh what's mm -hmm. it called? 
uh, what would you want was above, and then uh, you didn't ask for the statement, so like I just assumed that you just conceded the point when I said that like even the four tails he stated that the cadet chopper could even kill him, implying that the four tails is somewhat on the world Chimo's level like AP wise, like power wise, mm -hmm. you know, and you didn't really say anything about that. That's why I was bringing up the fact that like even Sasuke, that's why I was bringing up like the world Chimo's statement, how like even in that state world Chimo is still like. Yeah, it's like it's it's nothing. So like that's why I was like trying to imply that in this circumstance he scales above the four tails. Four tails somewhat scales other to to a Wojmo, Wojmo scales above Sonade, Sonade scales above Sakura. That's why I brought up like the Sani point. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Okay, so wait, where does that go into like uh Sasori and like Dedera? No, that was just like a Is separate this... point specifically for like the Sasuke above like Sakura. Oh, okay. Then from there, I'm going to be talking about, like, the Sakuas, like, whether it's at the Sasuke or whatever. Mm -hmm. And, like, just to be clear, I, I did 100% agree to, like, Tsunade being above Sakura currently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, like, uh, I'm fine with, like, uh, the Nine Tails and, like, the Four Tails state or whatever being, like, relative or able to just hurt Orochimaru. But Orochimaru having, like, more of, like, this speed advantage that just allows him to, like, weave all these attacks mm -hmm. and be fine with it, you know? So mm -hmm. I'm, I'm fine with that. Basically, what I'm saying is just that uh, in the cases that, like, you presented with Sakura... It's mm -hmm. Sakura in this state where she's like, uh, she's not in the right mindset. It, it comes off more like that. And like with the Yamato situation, it's just like a mentor being protective over the students, mm -hmm. you know? And then like in this situation, it's just her like, she's never seen Naruto in this nine tail state. So she just fucking, she's, she's like, whoa, what the fuck? She's crying and everything. So this isn't even like a serious, I'm trying to not get hit. I'm trying to whoop this nigga's ass, Sakura. This, <laughs> this is a crying fucking you know, kind of like mentally fucked up soccer at this point. So that's why, like, that's why I feel like, like, uh, using these to like, like lower her a bit is kind of like unfair mm -hmm. for the character. Yeah, and that's why for me, for my like, for my conclusion, right? So like, I kind of like somewhat gave up the point about like whole being like whole wider mind. That's why I brought up like the signing point, and like that's why I brought up like the power. And I did like a, a mini, mini scale within the actual scale. The proof that mm -hmm. like she was above uh that's like my conclusion for like a point so we can just get like tg when he's up later to judge this we can like still made in this point i know he up bro i know he up <laughs> I, know he I know he up bro he on the hub but let me chill out let me chill out <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so like you wanted to say continue with like my scale yeah or... yeah you can go to like your next point yeah so like if i did win this point um I would just say like Sakura is whether to the sorcery. I would say this based off the simple fact of like even Lady Chio is just like, wow, like soon enough she won't even need me. And this is like halfway to the fight and throughout the fight she just starts like just throwing the living F out of those puppets. So this is kind of mm -hmm. like full of proofs, right? Uh, it's one of these. Okay, things. so um, my disagreement with that, right, would be that uh, Lady Chio more so states that like Sakura is becoming more use. Like she's um she's understanding how Sasori's like uh fingers move when he's using the puppets or something like that, right? Wait, let me see if I can find exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, you mean the bottom scan, right? Though. But yeah, she's more so using like like a level of what it be. I don't want to say like aimed. It's like a level of like pre call from the knowledge that she has of like how Sasori uses his puppets. That's what he uses. Okay. Yeah, it's it's more yeah. in the vein of that. Like if you so for example, if you know I'm always gonna throw a right punch and you know mm -hmm. exactly what my body does when I'm about to throw that punch, mm -hmm. you don't even have to really be on my level to know, okay, when he fucking twists his ankle this direction, he's about to hit me in the face. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like I, like you you do like martial arts, right? So yeah, when yeah, you're yeah. fighting if you know when they're about to do a kick, they can even be a bit stronger or better than you. If you can recognize the patterns that they do during an attack. You can just anticipate it and then react. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. Batman isn't actually, like, the speed of a bullet, but he can dodge guns because he understands that when a person pulls it out, he anticipates more of, like, where they're going to shoot mm -hmm. and, and pre-plans for that. So that's how I see uh, what Sakura did in that moment. I would also yeah. say, like, she had a lot of advantages just generally. Like, immunity to Sasori's poison, <laughs> which is just, like... Yeah, yeah, fucking, there's a reason I'm not saying, like, she scares too and, and, Sasori. I'm saying and not to say, like, she wasn't as helpful <laughs> as she did. But Lady Chiyo was definitely helpful, too, because mm -hmm. she had, like, full knowledge of Sasori's, like, shits. Mm -hmm. So it was just, like, it was, like, having a full notebook of everything Sasori has, mm -hmm. and then his fucking poison, which is, like, his, 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 like, top thing, like, his best shit, and then being immune to it. It was really, like, this disadvantageous for Sasori in this occasion, right? And I and I feel like Sakura doesn't so much scale to him, it's just she kinda like she outplayed him a bit. 
I wouldn't like I wouldn't like okay so like maybe rebuttal to like your points. Um, mm. okay, so your first point was generally like uh, she shouldn't be relative because she was more like aim dodging in a way, right? That was your first point. Yeah. Okay, so first, yeah, so like the rebuttal that uh, so like when they see this right, they're fighting the what's it called the the third kaze kage right and you know like mm-hmm. immediately after this he releases like his 50 puppets which is supposedly supposed to be like his strongest thing which he states that he took down an entire country with this thing and next thing you know you see sakura without lady chio one shotting all these puppets and progr- mm-hmm. progressively just showing that yeah she is definitely relative if he if he if she i mean sorry if he's legit using his strongest thing at the moment and he she's one shotting and dealing mm-hmm. with it even if you want to say she had a little bit of immunity um hence why i'm saying that she's relative not directly scales to him i still believe she should scale relative because she was shown that she was she, one she was like one shotting all these puppets which is supposedly supposed to be his strongest thing which he did take mm-hmm. out of the country with right so i still believe that she should be uh relative in that circumstance right um and, so okay so my disagreement with that would be that oh, sorry, sorry. i've already uh I've already established the fact that like Sakura has this knowledge of how Sasori has to attack with his puppets, right? Mm-hmm. So she even like noted, I'm gonna read it like verbatim. Um, before he can strike, he must move his finger. That is the weakness of a puppet master. From his hand and arm gestures, I'm beginning to see the direction of his attacks. So she's literally like, you, like it's a level of precog. She's understanding what Sasori must do to even initiate an attack, and she's just pre-planning for it. You know what yeah. I mean? Like she, it's like. It's like if you if we were both playing the game, right? I'm on a controller and you just know what my button movements mean and you understand what happens if I move my fingers to the right, what I'm trying to do, you can just like fucking you can just pre-plan me. Like you just have this understanding of me to where you can counter my attacks before I even like am able to fully get them out, right? Or you just understand what I'm about to do and how to play against it. So that's why I don't feel like it's so much of like her being relative. It's more of just like it's more of just like uh what I explained previously, like with just understanding someone's patterns and then recognizing them and then working around that yeah, okay so like the we that um uh if i'm not mistaken when he when she when he does use like his ultimate which is like the 100 puppets i'm like 95 percent sure he's not using his fingers and he's just like using the what's it called this is so cool thing in his chest and he's using that to control so he wouldn't actually have like the finger movement when he's using his ultimate so like i think that follow proves that she actually is relative because you're saying that she isn't relative, relative because she's supposedly aim dodging and looking at his fingers mm-hmm. but when he's using his ultimate i believe he's not actually using his fingers he's just using that thing and that's in his chest to control all 100 so like she wouldn't actually have that so-called aim dodge so i feel like that should further prove that she actually is relative to this form of sorcery mm-hmm. well i would only actually like acknowledge it once you like show a scan for because like you know <laughs> i can't just like take your word on it if i didn't mm-hmm, see it mm-hmm, no, I, mm-hmm, that, mm-hmm. I feel like that's fair if i didn't see it <laughs> And we know puppet masters use their fingers to like manipulate and work yeah, the puppet. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna just, go off like uh, see you know. The chat though, here. Yeah, so if you could find that, then we could like speak on that. But like until then, I'm gonna just like we have this pre-established thing of Sakura just basically like aim dodging his attacks from understanding what he must do to attack and like what those uh finger movements mean. So it's more like her just like like it's just outplaying. Like she she just outplaying a dude. Mm-hmm. Man, it took TG the hell a long time to go come in here. Like, no cap. You know, like the, the missus was asking. I was like, you know, shit, shit. My fault, my fault. I'm here now. I'm, you know? He's like, my bad, my bad, bro. I was touching grass. So. It was hay, actually, you know, like shit. How they go to the barn, bro? You know. How long have y'all been debating for? I don't want to like interrupt. I'm just asking. About, real quick. about forty minutes. Forty, 40 minutes? minutes. Shit. 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 Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is anybody yeah, recording this? Much. Yeah, I'm recording. Yeah. Oh, nice. Solid. Okay. Okay. I, if you guys want, I could actually um, listen to the debate and then give my thoughts like afterwards again, yeah. just to like if you still want me to judge. Yeah, I could do that. Um, okay, but yeah, yeah, that's okay. cool. Yeah, I found this. Right, I'm gonna let y'all. I'll let y'all continue. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, so basically from this scan right here, it proves that like uh he's he's just using his chest, like when he said it earlier, he's not actually using his hand. You can see all like the cords coming from his chest right though. So like he's legit just using his chest and then like the power from that thing on the right side of his chest to like amplify the charcoal or whatever. You know how that's like puppet stuff work or whatever. 
Wait, so that was like mm -hmm. my fuller point. That's why I was uh, and like Sakura is showing like reaction. Like what yeah. happens like after? Because you were trying to say like she shouldn't be relative because she was aim dodging because she dead ass doesn't have the look with his fingers. That's why I brought up the point that when he's actually using his ultimate and he's using these hundred puppets, he's dead ass not even using his fingers. He's just using it. Because it kind of so from like looking at the picture, right? I'm mm -hmm. not even trying to be your ass. Like, I'm not even trying to be your ass. It kind of it kind of looks like he's using. It looks like some of them boys connected to the fingers, bro. <laughs> right, right, yeah, so especially ones way in the back, them boys look like they connected to something. Hold on, let me, let me. You want me to find another scan here? Yeah, like show me, just like um, show me like her reacting like these groups of puppets afterwards. Ah, uh, yeah, here's a here's another scan. You know, somebody's being about here, but don't count, don't count. Don't do that. Don't play me like that. <laughs> don't play me like that. Right, like, so you see him like controlling other puppets. His hands are downhill, and you see this thing is coming from his chest. Uh, so like, there's no really way of like predicting how can do if he if she can't. Okay, wait. Can you tell me like what chapter is? I'm gonna check this out. Like, you tell me what chapter. Mm -hmm. is? Man, it's really he'll be in a lot. No comment. Where did cheese at, bro? Where did cheese? Uh, Two hundred and seventy-three. Okay, thank you. You remember that joke about her, guy? We. Man's being a lot. Man's being a lot. <laughs> <laughs> And just, and just because you know, he was on the little, you know, another scan like full of proving my point. He was like, he's using yeah, his yeah, chest. Here, yeah, you know, you know, yeah. don't need to be a rat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, so there you go. Really the next chapter was him like, so, getting so wait, whatever. Right before that, right. This is this is my rebuttal to that. This is my rebuttal, so I don't just need that hanging. Yeah, Lady Chio states, yeah. Lady Chio completely flat out states, I'll take care of the other puppets. Sakura, aim from Sasori. So we have Sakura having this protection of Lady Chio from like getting overwhelmed by that. She doesn't need to really react to anyone. Because I think literally right after this, Lady Chio states like, okay, only go after Sasori. We then have like Sakura just rush towards Sasori. She's not even like paying attention or caring about any other puppets because as Lady Chio said, I got your bees. And that's it. Like it's not even her so much like reacting to anything. I don't well, see any like, reactions. Do you, do you do you need me to pull up like the YouTube clip? Because I'm ninety percent sure like she's out here just doing and then. I like manga. Like, manga is the official. Manga the official source. Yeah, but it doesn't change because it's still a canon source, right? It's for anime. It's, why, just, why, it's, why, just, it's still. Why wouldn't it be added anime? Right? Like if it's not, if we don't see it in the manga, why is it not like added? Why would that not be added material? Uh, it's not added. It's 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 sorry. It's added in like the anime just so it can be longer. It's more. Oh, content, can you show you know? me that? Can you show me something. Uh, and then it sounds like anime on YouTube. Real quick, we're on YouTube. Real quick. Sounds like anime only content. Anime only content. Okay, but it's <laughs> like anime only content. Seems right. Seems right. Somebody's riding right now. Uh, <laughs> Man's riding. I need now. you. I need you to leave real quick. Man's riding. Man's riding. On guard, he's riding. <laughs> <laughs> hurry up here. Let me let me see. I can find like a stamp here. <laughs> hold up. I swear I'm a good person. Man's riding real hard in the car. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Ah, crap. That's the cause of Kage's right now. Okay, that's 48. Pepper's coming in. <laughs> DG, don't do that. Yo, for anyone watching, I swear to God, I'm not a rat. Don't do me like this. Man's riding, bro. Man's is wild. Like, I'm just saying, look, is any means necessary? What are you riding right now? It's just added protection, bro. Don't do that. Don't do that. Why we got to do labels, man? I'm just being a true shinobi, you feel me? Right. Rat. Ratty shinobi. Oh, my God. I'm from the rat village. <laughs> I don't do this. I know you're not talking, bro. I know you're not talking. Well, I ain't know that. <laughs> the pot calling the kettle black, bro. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Here it is. Give me one second here. 
Right, so like uh, forty nine, okay, forty nine thirty seconds. Got you. Send this link here. Right. TG shaking his head, bro. Yeah, forty nine, forty nine, forty <laughs> seconds. Okay. Oh, 30 seconds. Is there. Man's riding right now. <laughs> okay, you see. Wow, this is riding. On God, he's riding. Stop. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna you, get so first. It's basically bro. showing, like, even before, like, Lady Chio starts, like, attacking, she's, uh, Sako was already, at, like, hitting and just throwing, like, a good three or four or five of them. Just proving that she's relative. So, like, my point before on that, they, um. Yeah, before like you talking about before he used the hundred uh the hundred puppets. No, no, no. This is doing the hundred puppets. This is doing the hundred puppets. Oh, okay. Uh, All right, let me look at this. I'm not yeah. Gonna... Yeah, just go at forty nine though. Before she like dives yeah, in right. and goes into like she goes immediately for sorcery. Yeah. So are these puppets. are these like um so these like puppets right? Where do these like individual puppets scale to in comparison to the other ones? Because it just sounds like because even like before this in the panel. Sasuke's like, oh, um, the true skill of like a puppet master is the amount of puppets you can wield, right? And we know like he has like this specific, like the third Kazakage puppet, which is like, you know, his fucking, his goat. Like, this is the dude he pulls out when he's trying to try hard, you feel me? But well, what are these? Agree, like, I, I would say the puppets. 50 puppets, I mean, the 100 puppets scales above the one puppet, hence why he uses that as like his ultimate, his last, his last thing, his trump card, right? So like, Good point there. I just feel like it's kind of invalid. Well, I would say I would say like more of the purpose with this. Pardon? No, I would say more of the purpose. With this is just to overwhelm rather than like straight up overpower. Because what makes them? Because literally, like Lady Chio is not complaining about them being strong. She's specifically saying like there's too many of them. So we know like the hundred puppet thing is more like to overwhelm the enemy. It's not so much as like his power, right? Like I'm gonna I'm gonna like nuke this nigga with this like with these hundred puppets. It's like I'm gonna jump this nigga with these hundred puppets. Yeah, you might not. That's more so how, like, I'm interpreting it, right? Yeah, that's really because that's, what, like, that's what's more... Yeah, that's really what it's showing you. Yeah, it seems really laddie. Yeah, yeah. You said what? I said it sounds pretty laddie, my guy. It sounds right. It sounds right as that. Look out. Yeah, so that, I would just go back to my last point of just saying, like, this is, like, his trump call. This is, like... His last form, because even when it comes down to like, we, we don't really know what the Kaze Kage has really done, except we know we have that one statement of him saying that he took down an entire country with these 100 puppets. So, like, even like statement wise, there's, there's, there's more, there's more, um, things that imply that this is more like his chump called his, his strongest thing in, in like together. So, like, together, mm -hmm. that should just skill above like his last puppet. So like whole being able but like to, what like, exactly states that like these puppets are greater than the Kazakage puppet? Um, I would just say that based off like simple feats of just like um him being able to take out an entire country and him Yeah, but like what was this country having, filled with? Like who was like, it filled with? Who was in the country? Uh, pardon? Like who was in the like if it's a country full of weak niggas, what what makes it you know what I mean? Like what's great about it? Like who did he beat with it? Who was in the country? Real niggas, goats. <laughs> can I hear? Can I hear some goat names real quick? Can I hear some 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 killers that was in that country? Cause I don't know. <laughs> it, it's just been weak niggas, bro. Hard like just weak. I would say either you know? or. I would say that like him having, uh, I guess in this circumstance, a country level feet depending on if you're talking about society or the country doesn't really matter we have no statements of of feats he has with like the kazakage so like i would just go back to my original point of even we have an actual statement showing that he's actually done more with those puppets than he has with the kazakage so like that just follow like backs up my point you want to like, well we know the kazakage was this point? Like, like i'm just gonna repeat myself Wait, no. So we know the Kazakage was like stated to be like the strongest of all Kazakage, right? Like of them all. I would disagree. This is like even. I would disagree. Okay, based off what? See, like when it comes when it comes to the strongest, like even at the very back of the third data book, it's specifically talking about like the weapon. Like even at the very beginning of like the fight with Ichido, like she she implies it's just like the weapon. Like you know how you have like iron over gold because that was the fourth Kazakage. Right? So you're saying like his AP is just greater, not so much like his general. I wouldn't stats necessarily like... say AP. I would say the weapon he had made him greater. Like for example, you could have a metal sword and I can have a wooden sword. So in this circumstance, they would say that you had the greater weapon, which is like flat out stated in the. Very 
the back of the third data book that he was known to having one of the greatest weapons out of all history. So I think well, I think you, that if, if I have specifically mind, right? implying the weapon because even for mm -hmm. like Garo and Kaz in the fourth Kazakage, we actually have feats. Like we know that like the fourth Kazakage took on the one tails. We have Garo going uh being uh, sorry excuse me um him fighting like freaking momishiki in the f in the future like we actually have way f better feats for the other two compared to um this one state well, which well, is really fully implying about the weapon which is fully backed up by the data book okay so i'm gonna ask you this right do you think i can like grab a sword and, and just because i have a sword and you have a bat but i have no skill in using a sword and, I, and i'm not fit enough to actually use it properly do you think i'm going to use the sword to its best abilities uh so your basic question is just like, would you use the weapon that you had? Okay, like, say someone weapon. had a wooden sword, right? They have a wooden sword. I have an actual sword that can cut you, but mm -hmm. I can't use it. I don't know how to use the sword. I suck ass at it. I'm not, I'm not Leonardo. I'm not Sasuke. Sure. I'm not none of them niggas, bro. I'm just sure. a random dude with a sword, and sure. I'm a fat guy. I'm out of shape, right? right. right. Are you telling me I'm going to beat you, someone who's more skilled in using a sword? More that's not what I'm implying. Me. I'm not implying the skill. I'm implying the weapon is stronger. That's what I'm. Implying. No, I know, but I'm saying to use a weapon effectively, you need to have these attributes to go along with it. Like I can't have a big heavy sword and use it great. Like just because you have a little sword and I have a big one, does that mean I'm like I'm better than you? That doesn't mean I should be declared the strongest. No, because if I can't use the sword well, and you can use your little sword better than I can, you can whoop my ass. <laughs> like you, you outskill me. That's not mad sauce. I don't, hey, bro, 2020. It's 2020. <laughs> it's 2021. I'm just saying, bro. like, to use the weapon effectively, you need to have, like, these other attributes to make it effective. Like, I don't think you can just have a great weapon, and that's all that carries you. Like, that just doesn't make sense to me. Yeah, but even when it comes to off that, like, like that's back to my point of, just, like, it's fully implying, like, the weapon, because it's, like, fully backed up by the very, very... Uh, back of the data book like you know what the data book would say to like, all the definitions of stuff like it's full of backed up there that it's more mm -hmm. implying about the weapon so it's like and plus we actually have feats for Gao and and we have feats for uh what's his name waza the fourth kazakage so like i would still put them above because we have feats when it's like full of implied that they're specifically talking about the weapon which is backed up by the, the data book itself i think the fact that the uh the kazakage is still revered as the strongest because of the weapon, yeah, right? Yeah. Because of the weapon, it, yeah. it, it doesn't logic. Yeah, but it doesn't logic make sense to say, well, it's just the weapon. Because, like I was saying, do you think I can like use a sword better than a sword master if they have a wooden stick and I have an actual well, sword? I think that kind of depends beat, on context. Beat, like, <laughs> I think that depends on context. Like if I have well, a sword that can break all reality, because, but I'm trash yeah. with it, I have a sword that can break all reality. And it's well, even chance, like in like, anime, have you them. ever seen a character who's trash at something beat someone who's better at using what they're just starting to use? You know what I mean? Well, there is like imagine if Guts can't move so, the sword, like, you know. Like you can. Like, could you really imagine if, like, and you, get really you know about like you're watching fiction? You can stop bad. Yeah, it's really fiction, good. but and, it is logic. Moment of second, you can just get better in the moment. Yeah, of, like whatever. It's, it's fiction, and random shit can happen. Of course, like fucking bitches can like fall down on your panty show. That's fine, right? <laughs> but there's still logic within the world. Otherwise, like if if gravity couldn't exist, right? There is logic. There, there niggas have to breathe air. Fish have to fucking breathe in the water. You know what I mean? There is these rant, like there is like these shits that separate itself from our actual life, but there is these things that actually stay like consistent with what we would have to do. You have to train to get stronger. You have to train to get good with a weapon. You have to train to be able to use that weapon effectively. So just saying like it's fiction is more of like saying, okay, well, I don't want to actually like speak on what you're saying. I'm just going to say like, well, it's fiction. It could do whatever. It's like, no, nah, it has to be some realistic grounding to a character being considered the strongest. And it couldn't just be off the weapon. They have to use it greatly. They have to be able to use it to this extent where they're where they're not just sucked off for just the weapon. So that's how I interpret it. That's how that's I see how I it. Interpret, yeah. So like basically you're interpreting that like to even be known as a song, it's not only just because of the weapon. You you gotta have a little bit of skill with it. Right? Yeah, that, you like, have to have like point. other yeah. attributes. And then my my general point is just like we it's more referring to like the weapon which is like full of backup of the data books and then like it's kind of contradicted because like we actually have feats for the other uh the other two full of kage kage so like i mean well, i would say that it's speaking more like um what would be pre like not boruto they're not saying like forever they're saying like based on what we're seeing currently this dude is still the strongest you know and gar at the time didn't show feats better you know what i mean like gar got whooped by dead era and what did he do after that? 
Like, I, I think he, well, you no, know, right. he was my daddy, right? Daddy. Well, like, <laughs> like, he, he was, well, well, like, he was kind of protecting the village. He wasn't focused on Dedera. Yeah, but, like, he, he was protecting the village. Out, Gar, could he was protecting the village, but still, we have, like, Dedera was admittedly saying that, oh, I couldn't kill him, you know? So we know he was holding back, so he's just, like, playing around, like, you know what I mean? So it's just, what I'm saying is basically that it wouldn't, bring it up, like, oh, well, in Boruto, Gar does this or Gar does that. Yeah, Gar trained. Like, Gar, Gar of course, surpassed the nigga who's been dead, you know what I mean? But <laughs> Up to that point, that when the character's making this statement about the Kazakage, he's saying what he's like, what's currently a available as information and what has been shown. And Gara at this, which has shown right, nothing, and going like a he, bit further, like we haven't seen anything from like yeah, that Kazakage. But I'm just saying, that means Gara. That means if if he still considers the Kazakage greater than these other Kage, other Kazakages, that would have to logically mean they have not shown feats up to this level. Well, it's just not upscale. specifically, because we already know that like the entire village had a complete bias against Gawa, which is like implied through the entire story. Like, I so just, you think, I, like, you think me, they mostly, would say really... Pardon? You think like, so we know like the bias that they had against Gar was just like thinking he was a mob shit, right? But he was still considered the weapon. Like he was the weapon. He was the, t why would it, it doesn't make any sense as a way to degrade Gara. To be like, oh uh, yeah, he's he's fucking doo doo butter, bro. Like, not nah, just say I don't like you, but you're strong as fuck. You could, you you fuck shit up. So I, I don't think like the them like not liking him for real, right? Or not really like, him, means they uh, downplay his abilities. You know, especially considering what Gar was meant to be for the village. It just doesn't make sense for that to be like how they shit on him. Like, why would Gar care? Like, why, like, why would that hurt somebody's feelings? Yeah, I see your point on that, but like. We would just basically just go back and forth. Like I would just bring up the fact that we actually have feeds for Garo, and I was like, mm -hmm. so I feel like in that circumstance they should technically scale both. And it, and both when it comes, and I'm trying to say like for, it's specifically for the weapon, which is fully backed up by the data book at the end of it. Like that's that's my that's my conclusion at this point. You want to like just conclude at this point? Oh, okay. So uh, my conclusion would be that I uh, that concerning like Sakura's feats, I feel like I defended the fact that she had this knowledge that allowed her to aim dodge. I defended her like not really even being relative to the puppets in any way because she's using this like pre-existing knowledge to just uh anticipate their movements and then when she like finally like hits sorcery she's not even dealing with like the puppets lady chio flat out is like i'll deal with the puppets you just go for sorcery so she's just having this one track mind because that's what the plan was and then um in regards to, like the kazakage i feel like i defended that point with the examples that i gave and um, I didn't feel like uh, my homie really explained why, what, so like, how Sakura didn't kind of just get, like, carried by Chio using, like, using them. Or he didn't write, he didn't even also explain why, uh, why the puppets that were in, like, the 100 puppet shits are even, like, greater than the Kazakage. Like, you know, I get the point that it's, like, it's more about, like, overwhelming the opponent rather than being, like, amazingly stronger than the opponent it's like you know there's strength in numbers so 100 puppets is going to be annoying for anybody like, like no one's going to want to deal with 100 puppets so i feel like i defended all my points well that'd be my conclusion for this yeah and then cool. that's like i already said my conclusion for like the uh it's called was it kazikage point but like my conclusion on the entire soccer point um i think i personally defended like the trump code thing about like the 100 puppets should like scale both uh the the, the third Kazakage puppet based off like we actually have feats for the other ones he's actually it's been stated that he's actually done more which is like the country thing we don't have it actually any statements for the Kazakage for the Kazakage what he's done with it um and then I brought up the point with uh that he should be that he should be relative to like that his trump card which is why I, I showed like the video someone that she actually did you know, box with a few of them before she directly went for the uh, for sorcery. So I still believe I defended the point that she should still be uh, relative in that circumstance. Okay, so what um, what'd it be like the next point? Well, from here, that's like that was that was basically my entire that was basically my entire skill. Cause you didn't you didn't attack anything from the very beginning of it, right? So uh, what's it called? Mm, I didn't yeah, mind better, that. Better uh, okay. course, course mark two Sasuke. You just like, you kind of just like, skipped over that, so I'm assuming you agreed, right? And then like course uh, mark. But, like just to speak on it, how would that like benefit? Like, what does it matter if Dedera is like relative to this curse mark Sasuke? Uh, so like the basis of the entire scale was like Dedera is relative to Kurosawa Mark Sasuke. Kurosawa Mark Sasuke is above base Sasuke. Base Sasuke is above Sakura. Sakura is relative to the Sasuke. So that would just put like Dedera above Sasuke. That was like my entire skill. Oh, okay, because I was also going to bring up the fact that like Dedera flat out stays the Sasuke stronger. 
right? And yeah, I feel like we should like contradict like, by like what I said. That's like, yeah, I'm saying that like, but even then, you would have to prove like why doesn't that just upscale Sasori? If Detera is someone who understands Sasori's abilities and is like he's stronger than me, right? Detera has no reason to lie. He has no reason to cap. Like mm -hmm. if he felt he was stronger, he would say it, or at least relative. Like I'm in the same range as him. I'm in this area. He's like, no, he's stronger than me. He's greater than me. And then like you would have to say like, okay, well, why is Detera not trustworthy? Why could we not take this information as valid? Because then every time you scale Detera, going off of the fact that you haven't said like in any way Detera's statement is like uncredible, right? It's not valid because Detera is someone we could trust to give this information. It just upscales Sasori. If Detera fucking fought Madara, then Sasori could definitely fight Madara too because Detera is saying that he's greater than him. So I feel like, yeah, like that I also like is a point to speak on. And then like hacks, yeah. right? Yeah. Like what is what is Detera going to do against the poison? Yeah, when it comes to, like, me, like, in my personal opinion, when it comes to, like, Sasori versus Dedua, if, like, for example, we were doing, like, equal stats, like, just abilities, I think it would just be, like, I think it would kind of be still me, because it would just be puppet to get bombs, and it would just be blowing up every two seconds. I don't really think anything. Mm, but I would ask, like, in this equal stat battle, right, because they can get hit, hypothetically, yeah, and even, yeah. like, in this situation, what is Dedua going to do when he gets poisoned? I would just... Like, if, if we're going off the fact that, like, for example, if you got the speed point, you want to say that Sasori would have yeah, the like speed Yeah, like, in advantage. this hypothetical scenario where I get the speed point and everything yeah, I yeah. said, you know. I would just say shit. that uh, he he just, uh, he just freestyles it, <laughs> like he did with Sasuke, and he just, like, blows him. Yeah, because I would say, like, Sasuke doesn't have poison, right? right? So the moment Dedder is hit, he's fucked. Like, <laughs> like, he's fucked. He can't use, like, his best a move, which kills him, right? The fucking shit, like where you have to like yeah, breathe in. Like, the poison slows him breathe. down over time, right? Eventually, he'd just be like, "I, right, I'm blowing this motherfucker sky high, no cap." Yeah, like, cause um, isn't doesn't he need to actually like have the individual like fucking breathe in the bombs and shit, and then like to blow himself up? Why wouldn't that's Sasuri? Cool. That's just, like, like a whole another jitsu. That's like a whole another jitsu. Yeah, like wouldn't Sasuri just leave? Like he would have to logically cripple Sasuri for him. Well, like, you gotta think, like, even doing, like, the fight against, uh, what's his name, Sasuke, the only reason why Sasuke survived is because he had the shot gun, which allowed him, like, to see these tiny, tiny-ass bombs that were, like, I forget, they were, like, the size of dust or something, and the only reason... Yeah, why, but, like, like see, even in that so have all that... Sasuke was weakened, right? Sasuke was weakened, it could still evade it. Like, he could still get out of it. Yeah, so, like, the only thing he could like, see was because he... of the shot gun, right? And in this circumstance, he doesn't have the shot gun, so, like, that would... Oh, Wait, let me send this to because it's like he also like can just shoot poison needles at people. So I thought that was just interesting. Like what? Well, like what is Dedera gonna do? Like the moment the poison hits him, he's fucked. I think like the bombs are just way more easier to deal with in this like in this hypothetical battle than it would be for like Dedera to deal with the poison lot. Like it's literally Sakura only does it because she's like in this medical field and she made this antidote to like counter it and shit. But Dedera doesn't have that. So, like, Sasori has, like, these means of attacking him with poison that just one-shots him. And Dedera needs this really, like, specific situation to, like, nuke himself. Because he would need to want to die. Like, he would have to say, yeah, I'm going to kill myself. But it's, like, realistically, if Dedera has this poison, then it's, like, he's done. Like, it's donezo. He wouldn't, it wouldn't get to the point where Sasori's going to be, like, within this area of range where Dedera's like, okay, I'm going to nuke my shit. Like, he's dead. He's going to get poisoned, die. You know, I don't see, like, his bombs being that useful. Yeah, in that circumstance, I would just bring up the point that, like, when it came down to his bombs, the only reason why Sasuke specifically was even able to react or plan out a strat was because he had the Shogun, which allowed him to see things that were so small. Because right? they were, like, I'm pretty sure it was stated to be, like, the size of, like, dust particles or something like that. Yeah, wasn't that, wasn't that with the, um, isn't that the ones you have to breathe in, though? That's how Sasuke noticed it, right? Uh, if I'm not mistaken, it was like all over the place. But I'm pretty sure, yeah, he yeah. did definitely breathe in. But like, only yeah, because I think like that was like the, the that's like the style. main thing. With it. Like you have to breathe it in. That's like the big problem with it. I don't think like normally it's an issue. Yeah, but either or, if he if it's in his um, what's it called puppy body, it would just blow up his puppy body. And he doesn't have any lightning style of my knowledge, so like I feel like. And then like uh, so another cool. issue would be right. So say we go with the logic that Mike scaling puts him above. Why would it kill? Like, why would it kill Sasori? Sasori can just reform himself back together. Like, if his a if he has like greater AP, then his durability would be. High. So then, if he just blows up, then he would just like either tank it, be broke, like be splattered around and shit, and just reform himself and, and go on his way. Yeah, I think uh, I think like uh, from an ego stats per, uh, 
perspective i feel like it would just kind of just go back and forth because you have like these extremely small bombs that i don't really see uh what's called saucy reacting to and then you have like saucy with the poison i think they, they both have a good amount of like strats they could use to like win in general yeah because i'm looking at yeah i think it is before puppets, you can always just make Sorry. bigger bombs so like you just blow up more puppets at once i feel like it'd kind of just be back and forth yeah looking at c4 you have to like breathe them in i don't see it like working as um as like him being able to just like throw them bitches out and you just blow up it says like specifically uh microscopic bombs that enter the bloodstream of anyone who's in range and breathe them in on dead arrest command the micro bombs detonate causing the victim's body to disintegrate at a cellular level turning them to dust so like uh if he doesn't need to breathe like if the dude doesn't need to breathe anything then like dead is just gonna like be stupid to use it he'd be like why do you use that and let me see if i can find it i mean like download he's gonna send it yeah i know what he's saying me to talk about i'm pretty sure i know what you're talking about yeah but like overall it would just go back to the point of like bombs depending on the size or like poison it would just kind of just go back and forth who can really hit who first in that circumstance but like overall i think uh i think we covered everything when it came down to this debate overall we can get like tg to judge it out <coughs> okay there we go go back here yeah, so this is like where it's like explained how it works. So I think like based off this, if it if it functions off like the idea that a character has to like breathe them in, and that's how Dedera uses it consistently within character. He doesn't just like blow them up normally, right? We're going like this, like how they would actually like use them, how they are shown to use them. And I won't like assume he could do them otherwise because he's never done it. So why would he do it in this in this situation? It doesn't really make a lot of sense. So like mm -hmm. the fact Sasori just doesn't need to breathe, C4 is useless. Like, the best one he has, I think, is, like, a CO. Like, he just boosts himself. I think that's, like, the best he got. Well, he has four different types of bombs. But even then, like, Sasori would have to, like, be retarded to just... Like, if he's greater in AP, unless it's, like, equal stats, right? Equal stats, I guess you can make the argument. It would just, like, blow him up. But Dedera kills himself. <laughs> so, it's, like, well, it's a lose-lose. Like, lose. You have the situation has, like, where, like, play, play either you make it a draw where he kills himself. That's, like, the one opportunity he has to win. And then you have these other situations where Sasori is just able to, like, poison him. And Dedera is dead. Like consistently, like there's no, there's no like in character bloodlusted whatever. Like Sasori can always effectively hit him with the poison, and that's like, Dedera is done. He's done. But Dedera has like this one situation, right? Equal stats, and if you scale him higher, that he can like actually do anything with the bombs effectively. That's like a big yeah. issue for. Uh, and then for I would Dedera. just bring up like the size of bombs. We know he can still like make like uh, what's those little airplanes, like the bullets or whatever. Yeah, the big ships. Yeah, I would just like Dedera yeah. like block them or like use the puppets to just tank them bitches mm -hmm. something among like that. yeah but overall i think we did good like uh, i think we could cover all yeah. the points we can get tg that does this uh tomorrow or something yeah yeah but thanks for the debate i got no go problem bro you had me dog <laughs> don't let nobody see i won bro i'm smoking that pack <laughs> nah, bro. nah bro i'm trying to smoke your pack no coke ah uh, bro <laughs> All right, so thank you, TG, for you're gonna eventually judge this. Thanks for D balls. Make sure to draw, uh, make sure to go sub to both the accounts. The both the yes, YouTube sir, will be yes, in the description. <laughs> with all of that, you know, I think that's it. When I got enough money to pay TG for a collab, y'all gonna see something. <laughs> oh, the foulness! <laughs>